The E300 electronic overload relay has a lot of useful diagnostic parameters to help a user identify a reason for a motor starter problem. These diagnostic parameters exist in the input assembly tags of the Logix controller, and they are also accessible via the internal web server. In this example, the E300 overload relay had a trip event. We can see in the input tag diagnostics for input trip present indicates that the E300 is in a trip state. We can determine the reason for the trip by monitoring the protection structure of the input assembly. The protection structure shows that the E300 had a phase loss trip. This information can also be found on the web server by monitoring the device status we can see that the E300 had a phase loss trip. Additional diagnostic information included with the E300 electronic overload relay is its trip snapshot. The trip snapshot captures the real-time information at the time of the trip. It will capture all three phases of current, the thermal capacity utilization, ground fault current, the three line voltages, and all the real power values. In this example, L1 current was at 0.52 amps and L3 current was at 0.52 amps. Unfortunately, L2 was at 0 amps. This is the reason for the phase loss trip. Using this information, maintenance staff can interrogate the E300 electronic overload relay remotely, understand the reason for the trip, and identify the reason why the trip occurred. In this example, we can send out a maintenance person to go and replace the fuse on L2 for this particular motor starter.